Okay, so we're here to talk about laser resurfacing today, and I'm going to go over our three workhorse lasers in our practice. So first we have the Cyton Erbium laser, which is used for more superficial resurfacing and removing blemishes and improving fine lines and wrinkles. And then in our AccuPulse Luminous machine, we have both fully ablative CO2 laser and fractional CO2 laser. So fractional is a step down from fully ablative. It's probably our workhorse laser where we actually can preserve some intact skin between drilling small holes in the skin to deliver heat into the skin and cause tissue tightening. The fully ablative laser is really used for those people who have very deep wrinkles and we need to get a total resurfacing on only certain, certain skin types. But I'll go ahead and just show you the differences. They each have different downtimes, the most being the fully ablative CO2, the middle being the fractional CO2, and then the least being the erbium, but they also accomplish different things. Okay, so I'm going to show you these three lasers in action up close, starting with the erbium laser, which again is more the superficial resurfacing. So if you come on close here, Leslie, for a minute. This is the erbium cyclone laser, and you'll see as I do it, you can see a pattern being generated there where that area, the outer layer of skin, or in this case the tongue blade, the wood, has been removed. And it also gives some heat to the skin, but not terribly deep. Now on the other hand, when I use the fully ablative CO2 laser, which is our luminous acupulse laser, if you see here, I'm going to put it right next to the erbium laser and just fire it a few times. What it does is it ablates that entire area, but this heat generated from the CO2 penetrates much more deeply than the erbium. And next I'm going to show you the fractional CO2 laser. Filling small little holes in the skin to deliver heat, but preserving some skin in between. So you'll see more of a grid-like pattern. I'm going to go ahead and start. So you'll see on the right-hand side the little drill holes from the fractional CO2 laser. The center is the fully ablative where everything's been removed. So on the right-hand side, the center is fully ablative, which is more effective, but more downtime. On the right-hand side is the fractional CO2 laser with the intact skin cells, less recovery time, still effective, not quite as much so as the fully ablative. But that's kind of highlighting all three lasers.